Hello and welcome. Uh, my name is Lydia Alden and I am the school counselor at Bishop Camden High School and I am also the teacher of freshman seminar. So I just wanted to show you really quickly, show you around a little bit, tell you what's going on um, and say hello. Um, I have been really, really enjoying working with the freshmen. I to make sure our class is really enjoyable and that we're learning a lot. So the whole premise of freshman seminar is just that we wanted to have an opportunity to work with the students and kind of build up some skills that we feel like they need to be successful. So those skills include um, the areas of academic skills. We've been doing a lot of stuff regarding note taking, being organized, where to sit in class to learn. Um, we're going to do some career exploration and help the kiddos learn a little bit more about themselves. And we've learned about and we'll learn more about social and emotional learning. So hopefully at this point your students can tell you a little bit about that, but they may not remember off the top of their head. But that includes skills for getting along with other people, understanding the needs of other people, and you know managing your own emotions and making sure that you can be an emotionally and spiritually healthy person. So we are going to be doing a lot of different things and I like to utilize um, a very student-centered environment. So I like to be very responsive to make sure we do a lot of fun things. Um, and we definitely have had kiddos that are sometimes virtual and sometimes in the school and um, it seems to be working pretty well so far. So in, on a student's iPad, the stream classroom people grades, all of that is actually going to be flipped and those words will be at the bottom of the screen. But I navigate with everything from freshman seminar from the tab that says classwork. You can see that everything that we do in here is um, organized. We've got handouts and reference materials and then some of the things that we've done so far. So I have a lot of different materials. We actually are utilizing the materials from School Connect. Um, School Connect is a curriculum that we use for the social and emotional learning. You can see weekly what we're doing in here. Now the class is pass fail. So basically what I've told the kids is that as long as you're you know, you're showing up, you're participating, you're engaging, you're doing the things I'm asking you to do. That's all I need from you. Um, I really want it to be more of a community where we can get to know each other, um, kind of get acquainted with what's going on at Bishop Canavan and help the kids to be prepared to deal with um, the rigorous curriculum and just making sure that they understand how to be great students that are complete, emotionally healthy, and that they're able to have great and beneficial relationships. So you can see and hear what we're doing. Um, a lot of times the students will come in, most of the time in the morning we have bell ringers, and when we get there first thing, they know to come in and look and see what's, what's happening there. Today our bell ringer was a digital check-in, so the kids will come in and see what's going on. The answer the bell ringer, this one is a little bit longer than usual, just because it's designed to kind of do a, a, give me a little bit of a, a background on how we're doing. Then after the bell ringer, a lot of times we will review. Uh, I really love kids participating. I tell them that I am not a book bribery. So I typically have candy. Um, I struggle with names sometimes, so we have a ruling class that if they forget, if I forget their name, they get a piece of candy. They love it and I love it. Um, and whatever I gotta do to make sure that they feel comfortable and that they can really just throw things out there. We've been talking a lot about asking questions how important it is for learning to ask questions. These are the kinds of things that we do for the bell ringer. And then um, lately, we've been talking a lot more about um, how we can learn to use the technology we have at our hands. So there was an activity for the slides and we have a lot of times they have what's called guided notes. So I'll have them take notes as we go through an activity. Um, or if there's a handout, I will put it here. Pretty much that, um, everything I do will be here in the classwork. It's really not something to be concerned with. If a kiddo is missing something, I will let them know. I have a couple kids that are taking the class asynchronously, um, meaning that they're they're kind of engaging with the freshman seminar stuff um, during a different period than the core of the class. I always tell them, you know, put something in the stream or send me a message or just ask if you have any kinds of questions. So you can kind of take a look around here and see some of the stuff that we have coming up is a really fun activity. Um, I'm calling it Audiophile Scholars and it's a way for um, us to share music with each other in a school appropriate way and also kind of engage our writing. So students are going to select a school appropriate song. We will, for the bell ringer, we will be able to have their classmates listen to the song. So they're going to make a slide that includes the song, the lyrics, and then come up with a prompt. So this is the example prompt that I came up with, and that's what we're going to be working on next week. So I am more than happy to work with you, and if you have any questions or you know that your student needs some help, please just get in touch with me.